Edition Feel Good Breakfast Show. This is Espresso on S3. And don't let those cravings catch you unprepared because Chef Clem, back in the kitchen, I missed him so much. He's so beautiful. He's got two delicious ideas for you. It's quick and easy snacks that'll hit the spot, but with a bit of health. You know, it's quite important. Now, easy three ingredient, beautiful. Uh, you've got muesli style bars, which is going to be beautiful. You've got some chopped fruit with peanut butter and honey dip. This is going to be excellent. Get ready to whisk everything for a good, healthy diet. Chef Clem, I missed you, man. I missed you as well. You all missed you so much. I think next year we're not going to go off air. Yeah, we're, we're not going. Go, we're going to work straight through. We have to. Well, you, did you see a Jamie Lee? Look at everybody. Oh, like, oh. Oh. Yeah, I just heard that now. So, okay, don't worry. We'll, we'll still be here for you. We'll be here. Okay. What are we doing today? I'm ready. It's like, I feel like I've got my drumsticks here. I'm going to ask you to work on our peanut butter dip. It's so simple. Yes. First, I want to know, are you a smooth peanut butter kind of guy? Crunchy peanut butter? I am an any peanut butter guy. A I, any I, peanut I, no, butter? If you have peanut butter in your house, I don't care if it's chunky, if it's smooth. I don't care if it's like a different nut. Like almond, I don't oh. care. Like I, <laughs> just, oh. I got, I would do any, any, if it's the butter, I'll, then I'm good to go. It's one of those things. So I'm, I'm very happy about that. But I'm excited. So I'm gonna make a sauce. This is gonna be like, cause I mean the other peanut sauce I'll make it satay. You're right. So what's this one? This one, and it could almost be turned into a satay to could be Could you honest with a bit of salt yeah. in there, maybe some soy? A little soy. bit of salt. I would, I would even go with the same ingredients. So for your peanut butter dip, you got peanut butter, you got almond milk, you got honey. I would use, those three ingredients, anyway, yeah. to make it a satay, a little bit of soy sauce, a little bit of um, ginger in there, a little bit yes. of garlic. It's so easy from like sweet to savory. That's so true. And eh? satay is so satay, yeah. it's fine. Yes, live from S3, it's satay day night live. It'll be great. Coming right? soon. It's gonna be Coming good. soon. An idea. So, okay. We're gonna go, and this, this is smooth. Go crunchy if you want, absolutely. Whatever Perfect. you wanna do. You're gonna add some almond milk to it, and then some honey for a little, not only sweetness, I said this yesterday, and it's got a slight acidity to it, so it actually yes. brings up the flavor of everything else that's in your bowl. So that's you. And the consistency that you want is exactly what every car wants today. I got a hack for that, but I'm not gonna do it now, but you can actually warm that in the microwave to make it smoother. And, and to then, incorporate and a little better. Because sometimes it goes a little bit clumpy if you try to mix it in with any sort of colder liquid. But it's okay. 100%, 100%. For that, I'll do this now. Okay, right. what I'm gonna do, what do you is... Have there? Did you just mash a banana? I did. I did. I mashed the banana. How big was the banana that you mashed? It was approximately 45 cents. No, it's just joking. <laughs> it was a healthy sized banana, okay? And here's the thing, if your banana is a little riper than normal, it's perfectly yeah. fine because it's a little sweeter actually. So okay. go for it. Okay, so I pre-mashed the banana and then I'm gonna add oats. You got three ingredients, I got three ingredients. I, that's all we have, that, That's yeah. all we need today, that's I'm, all we need. I'm ready for this though, okay. I just wanna make sure that I get this incorporated. So this is the challenge, you know, you don't wanna start with all of it so that you need to actually watch the consistency. So I start with a little bit by little bit as I incorporate. I think it's a good idea if you wanna make sure you check because you don't wanna go half a cup in there and the next thing you know, you're a bit too fluid, so. And you're chasing lumps. You that's don't wanna do that, so thin it out first. Okay, oats are going in and these are like bog standard gewone oats, nothing fancy about it, it's oats. 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 Get that in there. How's it oats? How's Rot. it oats? Okay, oh, whenever you have oats, it, like if you're making cereal porridge on the stove, yeah. what are you eating with oats? As soon as it enters a bowl, you add a pinch of salt. Okay? It's very, very important. It brings out the flavor of the oats. So you want to do that. Nice. Then, peanut butter. Okay. And yes. I'm going to go, also I'm going for smooth. But again, smooth. at home, at home, go it's crunchy. Right? Go crunchy. I, I, but I like, the, I like the smoothness, but I think the crunchiness, there's a lot of character in there. There's a lot of texture you bring in to whatever you're trying to make. And uh, I, I have love for that as well. I have love for crunchy, I have love for smooth. Peanut butter in general is just my jam. Like, I really love it so much. Willie's have these, the, the box of the sachets of peanut butter, and I think they're so amazing. I remember being in office. <laughs> wow, when we were still back in office. Oh office. my goodness, yeah. I didn't even know you had an office. I thought your office was a kitchen. I, so I was so lucky at Willie's head office. I had a normal office, I had a kitchen, I had a lab, I <laughs> of had course all of you it. Did. It's amazing, it's amazing. So these little sachets of peanut butter, and they're totally amazing because when it gets to three o'clock during the day, yeah. and you know you've got to push because there's still a bit to be done, but you're feeling a bit depleted. Those little sachets are absolutely amazing. So good. Sachets is better than the tablespoon I used to take from the cupboard. <laughs> and it's, I used to do that, I used to do like a peanut butter lollipop. All it is is a tablespoon of peanut butter straight from the jar. I mean, there's nothing until wrong get with that. Caught, no, until you get caught doing it, trust me. Oh. I had many a hidings doing that. Oh my goodness. Now you're an adult, you can do what you like. Yep, exactly. When you like. Okay, cool. All right, my consistency is looking fresh. So I'm that's ready. it, that's perfect, that's perfect. All I'm doing is I'm mixing in the oats, the banana, the peanut butter. This is gonna get packed into Ooh. that little oven dish over there and it's gonna be baked. As that's say, it. like a muesli bar. And I think it's so amazing how these few ingredients 
yes. actually just become a perfect little bar. Check that consistency. Yo. Okay. That's it. Wow. That's wow. What? You see that? Smooth, my brother. That is just amazing. That's, That's next what we level. Do. That's how we do it. Okay, so if you wanted to, Carl. Yes, if I wanted to, what do, you, you, want what do you want me to do? You could add chocolate chips to this. I mean, I'm I'm here for it. Yeah. I'm here for G, it. G's just yeah. like. Hold on. I'm, can I do something better? You know, oh. given, given the fact, aren't we using Woolworths almond milk? Yes. Right? I'm going to suggest something, a game changer. Tell me, tell the people. Chuckles. I'm just saying, drop everything. Just drop. Just make noise. Su Chuckles in here. I'm just saying. He walked off because I'm onto something. You're welcome, Will. But I had to come back because I get Good. paid for the full set. Oh, the, for the full. Account. Okay. Well, that's okay. Fine. So here's the thing. This goes to the oven. Okay. It comes out beautiful, beautiful muesli bar. That's your sauce. So here's the thing. If you start your day off with the best note, which is a proper, proper breakfast, you know, your body's been fasting. Hence the word break. Break, oh, break fast. fast. There exactly. we go. Exactly. Exactly. Have something that you know is going to be delicious that you actually, actually, actually enjoy. Full of texture, full of color, colors. So the dipping sauce we got, the, yep. the little muesli bars we got, fruit. Absolutely amazing. Eat it in season. And that's the thing about Alaska Africa. Our winter fruit, summer fruit, doesn't matter. It's yeah. always going to be delicious. The bars, it's a delicious fruit and the dipping sauce. That dipping sauce, better than the one that we have on display, by the way. I'm just letting you know, I've tried my best. Better. I'll do what better. I can. Thank you. It's Thank you amazing so on just literally layered muesli with yogurt. Yes. That can be done on pancakes if you want to be a little healthy on the, not, not healthy, if you want to treat yourself on the weekend. This sauce on anything is absolutely delicious. I'm just, I didn't taste that yet. Do you want to taste that just to check how I did? Check my work there. You know the Matrix are getting their results today. Wow. So I just want you to give me my results to see if I passed with this distinction. I'm gonna and I'm grab entering a, university. I'm going to actually Thank like, you. go like different on flavors here. Pineapple. How much you think? So what I did was I tried to not, not over sweeten it. I wanted mm -hmm. it to be beautiful. And remember, if you want to get all of the ingredients, go to expressoshow.com. Grab it as soon as you can. It's going to be beautiful. What do you think? Flying colors. Flying colors, thank you so much. Done. I appreciate Amazing. it. Amazing. Oh, this is great. If you missed out on what we did, we did a lot and we spoke a lot. And I mm. feel like we need to slow it down for you. Take a look at this recap. I'm going to continue whisking this.